This video covers the features available to you with the Enviro Heat internal controller by the Eureka Hot Water Team. First off, remove the cover by pulling from the bottom of the cover towards you. The unit can be turned off and on via the power button. When the horizontal lines are lit up, the unit is on. If you need to adjust the current time, press timer. The hour clock will flash. Use the plus or minus to adjust. Press timer again. This will then allow you to adjust the minutes. Press timer to save. The set point temperature should be between 55 and 65 degrees. The higher set point would give you more stored hot water. If you are prone to running out of hot water, a higher set point temperature will help. Press plus or minus and the temperature will change from actual to set point. Adjust the set point accordingly and press set to save. There are three modes that the heat pump can be set to. In auto, it runs as needed to keep your tank hot. In eco, it uses heat pump only mode, but you need to create one or two on duty time periods. The final mode is vacation for when you're on holiday. We will cover this in a separate video on our YouTube channel. There is also a boost button that can be used in any mode. If you're using a lot of hot water and need a quick recovery of temperature, then press the boost button. This then uses an auxiliary element to heat the top section of the tank quickly. If you use eco mode, you need to create the on duty time periods called L1 and L2. You might set this around certain electricity tariffs or perhaps preventing it from running at night. One of the most popular options is during the daylight hours if you have solar power. In this scenario, then a single on duty time period is required. The larger the household, the more hot water that needs to be replenished. Typically the system will run for two hours per person. So four people in a house, it may run for up to eight hours to reach its set point temperature. So an on duty time of 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. would be recommended. A common misconception is the tanks will go cold overnight. Don't worry, they won't. They are very well insulated and only lose a couple of degrees in temperature overnight. To create these L1 and L2 on duty times, press mode until eco is displayed on the left side of the screen. Then press set. L1 start will now be displayed. Adjust the hours, press set, then adjust the minutes. Press set. L1 stop will now be displayed. Adjust by the same manner and press set. If you don't need a second on duty time, then L2 start time should equal the stop time. You have now optimized your Enviro heat system to save you more money. Don't forget to put the cover over the display. Thank you and stay safe.